we are from True Maths, and in this video, we are going to solve question number 11 of exercise 15.1. The question says 11 bags of wheat flour, each marked 5 kg, actually contain the following weight of flour. And this, these are the weight. The 5 kg bag contains 4.97 kg and so on. In the second case, it contains 5.05 kg and so on in 11 cases it is given to us. And we have to find the probability that any of these bags chosen at random contains more than 5 kg of fluid. So in this case, total number of bags, total number of wheat bags is given to us as 11 and we have to find the probability that these bags contains more than 5 kg of flow. So in that case, this is our first trial in which this event occurred. This is the second trial. This is third. This won't come because we have to find more than 5, not equal to 5. Okay. This is third, fourth, fifth, sixth. And the, again this won't be included. So there are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So there are 7 cases where this trial, the number of trials, number of trials where this event has happened is 7 times. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Okay. So I have to find the probability that the weight of the bag is more than 5 kg. So in that case, the number of trials in which this event has occurred is 7 upon the total number of trials is 11 because there are 11 bags. So the probability should be 7 upon 11. So this is how you can solve this question. Uh, I haven't written the question because the question is too long. It won't be able to uh, fit in this board. That is why I am not writing the question. I hope you can see the question from your book. Only I have written the important data. And this is the solution. The total number of bags are 11. And the number of trials in which this event occurring is 7. And event is, I have to find the bag more than 5 kg of weight. So in that case, probability will be 7 upon 11. So I hope this is clear to you. Still, if you have any problem, you can call us. This is our number. Or you can send us your query on WhatsApp. Please like and share our Facebook page by the name of True Maths. Thank you.